Last night, I left here and I got in a cab, and I... He, he took the cab to the parking lot to get his car. Which was a block away. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I got in a cab, and it was uh, one of those little independent cab companies where the guy's name is on the door of the right. cab. But here's the deal. The guy had a TV in the front seat with him. Yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, I've had that, too. And I'm thinking to myself, now, I was going to actually have him drop me at two different places. I'm going to have him stop one place where I drop something off and then go to my destination. I was going out to dinner last night, and, and I thought, okay, I'll just have him drop me at home, drop this thing, and I'll go, and boom, and you know, be there. And I got so freaked out by the fact that the guy, when he was, when he was driving, would like tip his head to the right to, to keep one eye on the road and then one eye... On whatever, on Jenny Jones or whatever it was he was watching on TV. I want to say the John Ritter yeah. tribute. Do you mind? <clears throat> and and the problem is, his dominant eye was on the TV set. Oh, of course. Well, you could pretty much drive blind in this town. That's illegal. I hope he knows Sir. that. Well, uh, so I decided once we got home, I just said, yeah, that's it. Thank you. you, can, I, you can go I, my conversation was, I got in the cab, guy had the TV, and the TV was on. And he said, uh, I said, uh, would you mind turning off the television for me? And it was one of those, well, what's the problem? I said, the problem is I'd like you to watch the road and I'll watch the TV. He says, well, you know, it's my TV. I said, no, you better go back and read the cab ordinance again. I get to control the radio, and in my world, that means I control the TV, too. The you are an infidel! The passenger can ask you to turn off the radio or to change the station, and you need to do that, and I'm asking you to turn off the TV. And, and, and he was still snippy about it, and I just said, okay, let's pull it over. What do you mean? Pull Citizens it over. arrest. I'm Citizens getting, arrest. And I get out. And I pay him, and I make him give me the exact change for whatever it says on the meter, and then I go find another cab. I won't put up with it anymore. I won't. Now, and it, that's why the Al Qaeda hates us. Here's a guy on TV telling the guy to turn the TV off yeah, inside right. his cab. Yeah. But then the guy immediately gets on his phone, <laughs> and he, he calls for reinforcements. I get it with the the you know, and I don't, I don't care what your uh, country of origin is. I, I would ask the same thing of any cab driver. I, you don't need to be watching a TV. Especially when it's on it. Channel 5. Yeah. Yeah. That's when he really That's gets what nuts. That's did it. That's it. Pull over. <laughs> Pull I'm over, pal. I'm sick of watching Jerry Springer. I'm not going to do it anymore. Warner Sanders, Warner Sanders, Warner Sanders. You know what we ought to do? We ought to get a universal remote. <laughs> so that from the back seat you can run his TV. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> Have it built into your cell phone. <laughs> That's the next step. A remote what are you doing? in what are the you cell doing? phone. Run me, dear. What are you doing? I'll have. 